I'm James. And I am also James. And this is Video James. Columbus Day. That's right. We nope. broke into people's houses and stole their sh That's what you do on Columbus Day, right? No. Oh. And we probably don't need to put this on YouTube. They're not really looking for me. Yes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Anyway, where do we go, James? We went to Game Haven. Game Haven. Not uh, New Haven. Not New Haven. We went to Game Haven. It's a much shorter trip than New Haven. It's actually Weatherford, Texas. Excellent. Old school, hallelujah, video game store. Love it, loved it, loved it to pieces. If it was, if it was a girl, I would kiss it. That's how much. If you were a girl, I'd kiss you. That's absolutely. We can't put this on the internet either. We can't no. put this on there either. No. Yeah. I mean, we're just, we just. I mean, we're just. We're really just I, I phoning leave. in the show this week. You know, we don't get to gang chase together very often. We don't nope. get to go on hunts together. No. Nope. So, uh, it was really, actually really fun. Um, uh, the next hunt you'll see will probably be James and my wife, because she was so jealous that she didn't get to go. So, we got to make that up to her. And we'll also get the walk of shame. You will. Yes, we will. The walk of shame. Okay, here's the walk of shame, guys. The walk of shame is when my wife is looking for something. And it is not there. And it is confirmed not there. And what does she do? She walks around the whole store looking for that thing. And it, five times. Five times. Oh, she walked around SGC. I I don't know. It was it was way too much. It was it's hilarious. Yeah. The walk of shame. Uh, she just is so defeated by you know and. It's kind of like, and then she'll do the walk of shame, and we'll be leaving, we'll be like, okay, well, we better go do this, do this or that, you know? And she's like, no, can we get one more place? You know, like, you know, just like, oh, there's one more half price book. There's there's one more game exchange. Let's, go, you know, we're in, we're in Weatherford, but let's go to Waxahachie. No, I mean, if, and if you're familiar with Texas geography, that'll probably blow your mind how far that, that distance is from that. And you're gas tank. Yeah, well, hey, it finally got cheap. Cheaper. Yeah. Yeah. So. Nothing bad. All right. So here we go. Enjoy. All right, guys. We're back um, from that little short little break of me going and getting my stuff. Oh man, you know it's it's a real problem when you're reaching around and you grab the your wrong, the wrong sack. <laughs> you're highly tainted. Huh? You're very. Tainted. Who told you about that? Only my wife and my doctor knew about my high tank. Oh, oh, none of this can air. None of no, this show. None no. of this show can air. None of it. Well, I gotta get my fat in here. Oh. Oh. Alright, that's better. There's a rumor going around that we don't wear pants. So. But we're wearing pants. I, I wear pants. Yeah, we're both wearing pants. Okay, anyway. So what'd you get at Game Maven? Game Game Haven. Game Haven. Anyway, uh, I got a, uh, I got Soul Calibur for Dreamcast. Uh, yeah, I did that. That's, that's the first Dreamcast game I ever played. Really? Yeah, my friend uh, went to the Marines and uh, left your Dreamcast in his own house, and it was the first thing he the first thing I played. I had it for a couple months until he got back from the Marines. Actually, I had never played this one, and uh, I played the other where they added the characters in. For different systems. And that's the first one. I know there's like Soul Calibur 2. Yeah. But what is what is the other one? Soul. There I think there's legends. No, no, no. There no was, I thought it was like one before at like Sword Fighters or I, I'll have to look that up. Because I know there was one before. And then it's in yeah. that's where the title change came. Yeah, because it was actually on, on the original PlayStation. And right. The, the weapon space Tekken basically. Right. All right. We have Slave Zero. Ooh, we got the glare there. Okay, Slave Zero. Uh huh. Uh, it's a giant robot fighter, pretty much. It's a. It's actually four player. There you go. Um. It's it's got the controls are a bit weird. Okay. 
Infograms. It, 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 and it's and it's dream it's Dreamcast, so the controls are gonna be a little weird. But uh controls are kinda wonky. But uh, overall I like the game. It's again, it's before that stuff got standardized where uh where where people actually, you know, said, Okay, well we're gonna make sure that the left stick is for moving around and the right stick is for looking around and that's how it's gonna work. And I, I really like that, but it is there's something to the mastery. But of, then again, there's the Dreamcast. With its what with, it, with its weirdness. It's amazing it failed. It's amazing. Not really. Alright. Uh, uh, yeah. Next thing I got was uh Dragon Ball Z Ultimate Power Battle. I mean Never Ultimate Battle twenty two. Never heard of it. Pretty good, I uh, think. Yeah, I mean, for me, the fighting was a little slow, mm -hmm. a little, a little slow. I like the two D though. I, I do That's love what's the two D. fun about it because it's a but, it's a cartoon and it's kind of fun in two D. But I'm I'm used to something a little faster. Oh yeah. And, and the movement, the movement in the game, it's a it feels like they could have done a little more. So it is indeed not an ultimate battle. Another Infograms game, by the way. Yeah, Infograms. I mean, yeah. Grams. For, for being a, for being a Dragon Ball Z fan, I I say get it. Uh, for myself, I am a Dragon Ball Z fan. That's why I got it. I, but otherwise, I want to try it. Yeah. Huh? I'm gonna try that. But yeah. That's, that looks cool. I got a game cap it anyway. All right. And many of you have played this. I mean, as classic. a classic, classic game, Spy Hunter. Again, I mean, you can see that in the camera. The Game Haven prices are they, outstanding. That store in itself is a hidden gem. We, everybody makes hidden gem videos. That store is a hidden gem. I saw things like, you know, stuff I got on PC, but I, I kind of wouldn't mind having it on Xbox. I mean, they had uh, really good prices on both the Star Wars games for Xbox, for original Xbox. Excellent. And, uh, of course, I bought a Repro Nintendo, and it didn't, and you can't have a, a bunch of Nintendo cartridges without having... He bought an excellent Repro Nintendo, I, I want to add, and uh, we'll probably do an episode on, on, on that just that system. So, I had to go and get this. And yes, that's what I paid for it. I, I don't mind flashing that off. That's $2 more than I paid for it at a pawn shop, and I don't even know if it works. But you can't have Nintendo anything without having that. That's kind of the basis of having yeah. that. Do you have a light gun? Do you drop it in more milk? No. Okay. Okay. I've got two gun cons. I just don't have a zapper. So, I mean, it's, a, it's, it's way over there. Yeah. And then he gives me crap about this, but... Marvel Nemesis. I do like this game, and I know I know this isn't everybody's favorite. I just happen to be big into comics. You are too, which I don't understand why you don't oh, like it. Oh, that's why I got it, because I'm really into comics. I like fighting games. It sounded like a good idea. Just something about it. Just Something about the execution on it, I did not like. I, I tell you what, it is better than the Nintendo DS version, which I've also played. All right, and then, okay. and then once, one of my favorites, one of my favorite series, Ace Combat, and uh, this particular one, uh, you don't get you, you don't get lost. Uh, they they uh, every every time Ace Combat came out with with a, with a new part of their series, uh, the maps and everything got a lot better. Uh, I I do have a lot of flight simulators uh, in my collection. Oh, I would, I highly recommend this one. But. You done? Yeah, I'm done. Okay, all right. <clears throat> okay, so I'm gonna start with uh, Game Boy Advance section. I'm a huge Game Boy Advance fan. After he caused the fiasco. Fiasco? What'd I do? First of all, I didn't get Nintendo'd. <laughs> so I bought, I, I'm, at, I'm at a thrift store and I'm really excited because I'm getting like Banjo-Kazooie, Banjo-Tooie for like $12 for both of those. So I, you know, start looking through stuff. Ooh, a Metroid Zero Mission. Sure, I'll take that for cheap. Take it with me. I get home and I play it. It plays fine. First of all, I did have trouble getting it into my DS and my Game Boy Advance, which should have been my first. Should have uh, been. Should have known. Should have known. But yeah, it was. Uh, it was a Nintendo cartridge. The fine people at. Uh, Found it. Electronics pointed out to me when I brought it to them. <laughs> I missed that. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how I missed it, but it was a Nintendo cartridge, so I took the Nintendo cartridge, and uh, they actually gave me two dollars for it. I guess they're going to use it as like a way to like show people like what to what to look out for. Not I don't to know. To be like this guy. That was really nice something to give me anything for it. It wasn't what I paid, 
for it, it was I paid much more, but not. I wonder how more. often the Nintendo. People get Nintendoed all the time. Really? Right. <laughs> anyway, so uh, Sword of Mana, Sword of Mana. God, I'm getting old. Sword of Mana. Was that heavy? No, I'm just old, and I was trying to hold in a fart. But the kids at home. Sword of Mana, excellent game. I believe it's a remake of Final Fantasy Legend or Adventure. I'll have to look that up yeah. and we will cut to correct information later. Does not have a cover. I'm gonna have to get a new sticker for it. Um, doesn't say Nintendo though. So that's good. Good plus. Uh, Pokemon, Pokemon Ruby, at least that's what they tell me. Uh, I am man enough to buy the cartridge, but you, you kinda know what you're getting when it's red. It's Ruby. It's, Mo it's, po it's Pokemon Ruby. I don't not, think there's any. Re not Red Wings? What's Red Wings? Like the shoes? No. Oh. You you never heard of earning your Red Wings? No. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> I don't know what to No, no, say tell that. me. I'll I'll do the I'll do the okay. blackout thing again. All right, earning your Red Wings is whenever. You made me throw the Pokemon. No, no, don't don't describe it anymore. Your, your no, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> Try to keep this show PG. All right, uh, Desert Strike. Can't go wrong with Desert Strike. My wife thought I bought a sports title, but uh, <laughs> no, Desert Strike. Good. Return to the Gulf. Great game. Little did they know we would return to the Gulf later. No, nobody made a game about that. No. Sure didn't. Uh, well, I think they did. It was, uh, I think, isn't, isn't that what, or was that in, it was Afghanistan that the Medal of Honor was it? No. no. I thought, okay. what about Desert Storm? No, no. Conflict Desert Storm was yeah, before we yeah, reinvaded. It was set in the 90s, yeah, and then right. it's like, I'm trying to think of, it came out, and like, two years later, we're, we're, here we are, back, you know, back to Iraq. Anyway, I think not gonna, let's not get political on this show. No. No one, if you're watching this show for political, any kind of coverage like that, you're in the wrong place, bucko. All right, uh, Star Soldier. Star Soldier. I told you I'm getting old. Star Soldier Vanishing Earth. Never played it. Going to. Going to show you some uploads of it, hopefully, soon. Uh, believe it's a space shooter. Believe it's even a top-down 2D space shooter, which is really rare for the 64. It's kind of strange, you know? They were yeah, all about is. pushing subpar polygons. <laughs> I mean, you, you love it, because that's, that's it's, they got more personality in games do nowadays. More charm. Speaking of personality and charm. Here it is. Completed my PlayStation set. Old Swivel Hips himself. Old Swivel Hips himself. Gabe Logan. In Siphon Filter 3. Funny story about this. It says, one disc on the side. And when I was at that you saw my if you saw my pickups video I talk about going to Cleburne and the guy grabs the grabs it open looks through you can't you can only find one CD yeah there's only one CD in the first place so the guy did a lot of work for nothing but I if we'd have just turned it on its side every every time you see one of these thick ones here right there and yeah there it is disc it says one disc so keep that in mind when you're out there because I mean I got it for a better price at this place but, you know, you can't go to Game Haven every day, every Monday, every Columbus Day, maybe every Columbus Day. It's coming off of there. Anyway, uh, great memories playing at home. Skate or die. And by Check the way, I was nice enough to point it out. To, to not me. snipe it from out from under me. That was nice. All right, and I uh, recorrected some uh, uh, past uh, uh, problems here. I was really light. I thought there was nothing in it. Anyway, uh, uh, when I bought my Nintendo, I had to put two games back. I ended up with just From Russia With Love and a Nintendo and... And a Nintendo. A, a, not a no Nintendos. Uh, and a, uh, a, you know, like a Mario game or something like that. So uh, I got Time Splitters 3. Seriously, played so much of this in college uh, with my buddies. Um, love the split screen. Um, I believe it's 
we can probably actually we can actually system link this if you ever get it. We can play. It's a lot of fun. It like does a parody of like all the different uh, popular stuff, World War II, Resident Evil style games, things like that. Really great. Uh, I think if they made a movie, Statham or Vin Diesel could play that guy. That or you can that. get Franchise Viagra and just throw The Rock in there. The Rock, Franchise Viagra. Love there you that go. guy. All right, so that was our trip from uh, from uh, Game Haven. Um, you know, check them out. Great store. I'd like to leave on a joke, but. Got a it's, joke? It's the show. That's the show. <laughs> that's, that's it, guys. So, 